Which do you prefer? A healthy, loving relationship, or a very successful career? Your challenge in life seems to be able to have both at the same time. You can most definitely have one or the other. The reason for this is mostly due to the fact that you only know how to focus your energy in one direction, so trying to juggle between a successful intimate relationship, or a successful career is a bit too much to take on all at once. This doesn't mean that you don't have a good heart. You do, but it all comes down to your ability or inability to focus your energy in different directions at the same time. You are very creative and possess tremendous artistic abilities, but your quest for money can be so strong at times that you often ignore these qualities. You are also very intuitive, but again you probably won't acknowledge your gift because of your material interests. If you were to slow down and connect more with the creative, intuitive side of life, you could feed your soul in very significant ways. When it comes to intimate relationships you can have a difficult time making clear decisions about what you want and what you don't want. You like to spend a certain amount of time alone, so having a partner that's away most of the day is ideal for you. The best way to face this challenge head on is to travel with your partner. That always seems to pacify your fickleness. You sacrifice a lot for your family. You always seem to be caught in the middle of all of the family disputes, mainly because you are just the person to figure things out for them. You have a very balancing energy about you when it comes to family politics. And this seems to encompass finances, work, play, emotional entanglements and so on. In addition to all of this you have an artistic talent that can't be denied. You have a true appreciation for all things of beauty. You can also be connected with the healing arts on some levels. If you weren't so busy handling family situations, you could probably devote more time to various healing modalities. You have to walk a very thin line when it comes to giving because this can sometimes lead to you giving too much of your time and energy, something you may not see returns to you equally. This can lead to you feeling taken advantage of. Always keep a healthy balance of how much you give others, and how much you take in. Create healthy boundaries and know your limits. You are also very responsible when it comes to paying your debts. You like to be appreciated. The key to a successful life is to focus on your healing abilities. It'll help both you and others tremendously. You are a good friend and a faithful companion. Because you were born under the astrological sign of Pisces you can be sensitive, intuitive, adaptable, helpful, imaginative, creative, kind and caring, trusting, wise, easygoing romantic, even-tempered, multi-talented, friendly, compassionate and popular. But you can also be an escapist, enigmatic, gullible, fickle, vague, otherworldly, idle, absent-minded, overly sensitive, secretive, impractical and easily let down. Here are some suggestions on how you can bring positive change into your life. Don't worry so much. Try to be happy, be a leader, be proactive not reactive. Balance your logic with your emotions, be sure of your choices before you act on them, go the extra mile. For God's sake stop being a victim, and stop with the bloody self-pity. Change your own circumstances, take back control over your life and learn to love yourself and others unconditionally.